expose whatever it is that God has not ordained for me. Begin to expose that thing. You don't want it in your life anymore. You don't want to leave here the same person in the name of Jesus. You are declared for freedom. You are located for freedom today in the name of Jesus. Um, okay, I think that's a Lorm says he's back. So maybe Casey will come in a second. Can I speak to Dali Wajardo? Wajardo? Yes. You're welcome in the name of Jesus. Where are you from? Thank you. Uh, Dallas, Texas. Let's pray together in the name of Jesus Christ. Holy Spirit, touch your daughter right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Let your presence fall upon her right now from the head to the soul, to the toe, in the name of Jesus Christ. Spirit of peace, locate her in the name of Jesus. I speak against that spirit of fear hiding in her life. That spirit of fear that makes her wonder what next. Can God really do it? Can God really fulfill his promise to me? I speak against you in the name of Jesus and say, stop talking in her life in the name of Jesus. She is a promise carrier. She is a promise child. It's the promise of God to bring her to this generation. And God will use her mightily in the name of Jesus. You will stand against her, but you will fail completely in the name of Jesus Christ. Holy Spirit, begin to strengthen her by your spirit in the name of Jesus. Anywhere that spirit is hiding, that spirit that gives her pain in her body that gives her discomfort and makes her think has God really found me why am I suffering like this if I'm a Christian out in the name of Jesus Christ out in the name of Jesus Christ out in the name of Jesus Christ holy ghost fire holy ghost fire holy ghost fire 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 in the name of Jesus Christ right now her head her heart her hair her hands fire in the name of Jesus Christ fire in the name of Jesus Christ Fire in the name of Jesus Christ. God's blessing is for you today. Today is the day of your freedom. Your life will never be the same after this encounter in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. You used to have nightmares. Can you tell us what, what kind of things you used to see in your dreams? Uh, I used to always have like my mouth full of something black and just gooey like it wouldn't let me speak and I had that dream repetitively you know over the years another dream was also like I was I would miss I was like in school and I would miss one class and not realize it until the very end when it was too late I'm gonna pray about that and I when I was praying for you, the, the Lord showed me your stomach, that you usually have some kind of pain or issue with your stomach. Yeah, lately, maybe started a month ago, mm -hmm. had stomach issues, and I'm not sure where it's coming from. Have you gone to the hospital about it? No. Jesus has located it, so there's no, you're going to be completely free. In the name of Jesus Christ, you spirit that attack her in her dreams, we have located you. You have been exposed today in the name of Jesus Christ. Come no more in Jesus' name. Anything planted in her that is not planted by God, be uprooted in the name of Jesus Christ. Right now, I remove that thing, that substance, that whatever, that spirit they plant in her mouth to make her words be not valuable. That thing they plant in her mouth to silence her voice when she wants to speak for the truth and speak for Jesus. Be removed in the name of Jesus. Be removed in the name of Jesus. That career blockage, that family blockage, that relationship blockage they are putting in her life. Out in the name of Jesus. Be consumed by the fire of the Holy Spirit. Be consumed by the fire of the Holy Spirit in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Any chain Satan has used to connect her to himself, be broken today in the name of Jesus. Be broken today in the name of Jesus. Be broken in the name of Jesus Christ. Okay, put your hand, one hand on your head and one hand on your stomach, please. In the name of Jesus. Right now, Lord, I touch her through my screen as you put her hands on herself. Holy Spirit, touch her through her hands in the name of Jesus. Touch her in the name of Jesus. According to the word that says, I stretch forth my right hand to declare deliverance and wonders right now. Deliverance and wonders in her life in the name of Jesus Christ. That stomach be free. That stomach be free in the name of Jesus. No more pain. No more discomfort. No more whatever it is in the name of Jesus. Out in the name of Jesus Christ. 
any way that thing entered you, any way they were permitted to do that to you, we revoke that license in the name of Jesus. We pull it out by the root in the name of Jesus, out of her life in Jesus' name. Your mind, receive the peace of God that passes all understanding. Receive Thank the you. peace of God right now. No more worry, no more thoughts, no more when is this dream going to happen again? What does this mean? What is actually going on? Isn't God happening to me? God is happening to you right now in the name of Jesus. He has located you right now. He has set you free in Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus. It's gone. You are free in the name of Jesus. Christ. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. The Lord told me there's something that you need to confess, a pain from your past that... Anytime you think about it, it gives you discomfort. It gives you a kind of sense of bitterness. This is one of the doors through which the, the demons have been operating to attack you. I don't know. It could be some abuse. That's yeah, I've never told anyone, but I think it was like a cousin of mine when I was little. And then I, one day she added me on Facebook and, and I just had that memory come to me because I was probably under nine and, and she molested me somehow. But yeah, like just the other day I was talking to my aunt and I, I was going to mention it to her, but I, I just keep holding back and I, I don't want to, I guess, mention it to anyone. You confessed it. Say along with me, in the name of Jesus Christ. Say with me, in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. I release forgiveness. I release forgiveness. I declare it is over today. I declare I, what? I declare it is over today. I declare it is over today. My past is over in the name of Jesus. My past is over in the name of Jesus. Lord Jesus, forgive me. Jesus, forgive me. As I forgive those who have wronged me. As I forgive those who have wronged me. In Jesus Christ's name. In Jesus Christ's name. Congratulations, sister. You are completely free. You are delivered today in the power of the Holy Spirit. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. So please join our testimony room and give them your details we want to follow up with you and see the wonderful things the way god's going to turn your life around god thank you. you god bless you all right and there you have it guys an incredibly accurate message of prophecy something that the lady in question had never told anyone according to her own words so if you are watching and you need a word of prophecy or you need deliverance and you don't know where to go, this is a place that you can do that on. Go to www.hungrygen.com deliverance to sign up for a slot in our next online digital deliverance event. To receive a touch from God Almighty, deliverance, healing, or maybe a word of prophecy. Also, if you want to get in touch with or follow Evangelist Ed, you can see his uh, social media handles in the description below. Remember to like, share and subscribe and see you soon again. God bless you.